is going on guys? This is Yarn here, and we're back playing some more Firewatch. That's right. <laughs> so, I just got off the phone, or off the little walkie-talkie with uh, Delilah. Because she, she was inquiring about how, how pretty I am and stuff. Uh, can we not use this? We can use this now. These are boards. We're looking for boards. Oh, there we go. We got one. We have to get a couple of boards. Oh, here's two. I knew I'd seen some down here. All right, let's see if we can find any more. A spigot, huh? What is you, spigot? Right, let's pop over. Yeah, <laughs> in case you guys missed out on the little conversation we were having. Uh, she pretty much just wanted to know. Oh, all right, we got water. Got water up there. Um, yeah, she asked me all kinds of random shit. About how I looked, how pretty I am. What? When did the tree fall? Was the tree always over? No, huh, I don't remember that. All right, I think we have. We should have enough. Yeah, there we go. All right, so we have enough. So we're gonna go board up our broken window that these damned teenagers did. Crazy kids. <laughs> and um, yeah, based on the response that you guys have given me on the the series, looks like you guys are enjoying this about as much as I am. So uh. We're gonna go through and we're gonna do the whole thing because uh, I'm kind of curious to see uh, <laughs> what actually happens because this thing is pretty crazy. I mean, it's pretty crazy. So far, we've had people break into our place, uh, we've had some mysterious people shining I flashlights. I got that on window us. all patched up. Oh, there we go. So, what should I do now? What's next? Yeah. What's, What's next? Delilah? What do you, Where you think go? is next? Well, you've been the one giving me tasks for two days straight. Come on. What What's we do? next is you sit in that room until September 1st and call me at the first sign of smoke. Oh, what? amazing. Yeah. Why don't you let me know when you're mentally prepared for that task and uh, I'll <laughs> give it to you. Uh, are we ready for work, guys? Oh, are we ready for work? All right, we're ready. Okay. I think I am ready to tackle my <laughs> long term commitment of keeping this national forest safe from total destruction. I am glad to hear you've really thought this through. Hmm. Of course. Of course. <laughs> We've issued you a comfy chair to sit in and everything. Oh, you know, did it's he? It's not really that comfy. I mean, it's wooden and there's no padding. I think I actually got a splinter in my thigh this morning. I was about to say that, too. Aww. Well, regardless, take a seat. The forest depends on you. How are you supposed... What? All right. <laughs> well, we made it to day nine. And we're just enjoying some sandwiches. Having a nice afternoon? Oh damn, that looks nice. That looks pretty damn nice. Uh, oh shit, sorry. Yeah, great. Not too bad. I could get used to it out here. Shit, that looks That's sick. Nice. Look, um, look at I'm it. Called Just with look at it. Bad news. Two young women, Chelsea Stevens and Lily McLean, were reported missing. Hmm? We've got parents out in California who haven't heard from them in a week. Stupid girls. They were girls. supposed to meet an aunt down in Cody. If they're the girls from last week, then you're probably the last person to have seen them. Uh, <laughs> I didn't do anything. I didn't do anything to them. What about their camp? That wasn't me. You know that. Don't get defensive. Trying Look, to blend shit on me? It's not going to be an issue. Uh, Trying I mean, to if, blend if this shit on me? I'm going to Then maybe. Should I just not say anything and save us the trouble? Yes, just shut up. Just, yeah, don't. Yeah, don't. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was thinking. All right, Henry, thanks. Enjoy the sunset. Oh, I was up until somebody started scaring me, telling me I kill people. Well, that was a quick day. <laughs> All right, day 15. Henry. Henry, wake up. Oh, shit, son. Oh, what does a bitch want? What does she Get out want? Of bed and pick up the radio. Really? I was just enjoying my little sleep over here. And then somebody had to call me. Wake my ass up. Oh, God. What? Do you have a window for me? You gonna fix this shit? Maybe a little heater in here? It's fucking cold. What? What? What do you want? What? Hey, you big dumb idiot. The fuck did he just say? Oh, oh, let's let, let's flirt with her. Babe, it's late. Oh shit! I know it is. You sound tired. Hmm. 
I am. Are you having a nice time? The fuck? Oh, man. <laughs> what? This guy's tripping. Henry? Are you having a nice time? Sure. Are you? Everything good there? The fuck? Jules? What? Oh, sorry, Henry. Yeah, I'm good. Well, that's good. The fuck is he talking to? Well, I'll let you get back to sleep then. <clears throat> okay, Jules. Delilah seems nice. Oh shit, son. Mm -hmm. Sure. What the fuck? Is he tripping balls? What? <laughs> what? Oh shit, son. I think he's going crazy. He may have gone crazy. Alright, so we're pointing at stuff. <laughs> where, where are we going? A hike north. Is it too much of a pain in the ass to bring supplies all the way up to our towers? Well, I get my stuff hand delivered. Oh, how's that work? Oh, excuse the, the fuck out of me. Of service. You're out hiking in 90 degree heat and I get to do crosswords. Isn't life miserably unfair? Anyway, when you find the supply drop, remember it's not just for you, okay? Other lookouts, biologists, a few people get their food there, and I don't want to have to call in for more. I don't want to have to call in for more. loads of good stuff, though. Beans, prunes, jerky. You know, my sister eats six prunes a day. Six. Oh, She's, God. like, really precise about it. She's fucking She'd be great all over the place. she didn't need wheelbarrows full of marijuana to function. <laughs> Same. <laughs> All right, let's go. Wait, are we even going north? The fuck so, are we like, two weeks ago, you called me in the middle of the night. You were sleeping, I guess, and all I heard was the name Jules through the mumbles. I just thought it was so sweet. I wanted to wake you up, but then I thought maybe you were having a nice conversation, and I'd just be spoiling it. I hope you're doing okay, you know, when it comes to her. Oh, shit. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, we're, we're fine. We're fine. Good. Ignore I'm mumblings. Oh, uh, look. So, a couple of months before I took this job, Run. I oh. I was with this guy, Javier. Oh, oh God, he's incredible, going to... caring, sexy as hell. He was Quasi Mexican. <laughs> we dated for almost five years. Okay. I was working with the Wyoming Outdoor Leadership School, and I was obsessed with it. I wanted to be an instructor so badly. And I was sure I was going to marry Javier as soon as I could be bothered. Walls was also a good excuse to get out of town, drink whiskey in the mountains, cut loose. <sighs> then, um, Javier's brother got killed working in Gillette. Oh, and shit, son. For some reason... How did everybody die around this bitch? Home. Javier said it was fine. He'd go to the funeral, take care of his mom, stuff like that. It'd be easier solo. When he came back, he left me. Man. I came out here. I lied and told my sister he fucked our neighbor. <laughs> so that works. I lied to you. I came out here with a broken heart, just like you. Oh, okay. uh, I figured you've told me so much about you, so you know there's something about me. We both fucked up. Yeah, well, you fucked up more, all right? You lied to me, first of all. That's a big no-no. And then you eavesdropped on my <laughs> conversation with my imaginary wife. Oh, shit, dude. All right, so we gotta go northwest. So, that way? This way. I like how it says, to the supply drop. Oh, there we go. Well, that was hard. <laughs> it's all just chilling right here. Oh man, what's the password? They really need some new passwords. They just make it all like one, 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 one. There we go. But um, what do we get? What do we get? Food for other lookouts. Two forks and spruce. So let's take ours. All right, I got everything I need out of here. Time to chow down. Just yours, right? Who do you yeah. think I am? <laughs> As I just steal the other ones, I'm like, oh, yeah, we're just going to take the other ones. Hey, you didn't take all.
all of the supply drop food, did you? No, I just took two. No? I mean, I don't, uh, I'm hungry. <laughs> so, you did. I gotta go. I gotta take a shit, son. Get out of my way. <laughs> Oh, We've got fuck. a front row seat for what might be the biggest fire of the year. Yeah. Cornchata really flakes. Going. The fuck are you doing? Call it in. They'll send in a hotshot crew for some suppression, but I bet we'll be stuck with her for the rest of the summer. And really? she doesn't have a name yet. I usually think of something funny or something practical or a little risque when coming up with them. Hmm. But why don't you do the honors? Let's call her. Maybe the flapjack fire. So, no ideas, huh? How about Delilah? No, how about the Come flapjack? Come on, there's got to be something creative in that brain of yours. Uh, maybe we call it the flapjack fire. Can you sell that as a name? You really like that, huh? <laughs> yeah, no. I said I did. It's funny. That Fair is enough. not funny. Flapjack <laughs> fire it is. They'll probably ask me if it was a camp cooking accident or something. That was stupid. Really? So there's this creek down the hill, and, um, you know what my favorite thing to do is? Skinny dip. Skinny dip. What's that? I love to take a bottle of whatever I have on hand, plunge it deep into the water, and let it chill in there all day. And then, on nights like tonight, when it is so disgustingly hot, I have something nice and cool to drink. I learned that from my sister in Santa Fe. She'd do that with a bottle of tequila near her house and make margaritas the size of your head. You'd like it there. Oh, would I now? I've had bad time with tequila. I've had one too many bad experiences with tequila. A little reticent to try it again. Well, maybe you just need a new good experience with it. Aw, oh, damn. Uh, yeah, maybe. Are you looking at the fire? Yeah. Uh, no, I'm not. You yeah. should. Let me know when you are. Okay, I'm looking at it again. I love how they look at night. During the day, it's just smoke, but when the sun is down, you can just get lost. You're fucking tripping. Yeah. I think she's a uh, 420 yellowing it up over there. I'm glad you're here. Sure you are. Why do you say that? Why do you say that? Because I do. I'm not crazy. I mean, we've had such a good time, right? <laughs> really? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, chasing I don't around teenagers. Talk to the other lookouts as much as I talk to you. Not in the same way. Oh and damn! I know you're not really available, but I want you to know. Well, maybe it'd be nice to get together at the end of the summer. Um. Look, we don't have to plan or even talk about it. I'm. <laughs> I'm just having the thought. I wish I was over there. You would. Yeah, tramp. I wish you were too. <laughs> what? This guy goes along with it. Outside. We could talk. Oh yeah, I'm sure that's what you're gonna do. We could, um, you know. You know. You know. What could we do? Hmm. What? What could we do? Well. Everyone wants to know. Let me tell you. Yeah, let's hear it. Oh, come on. Come on. <laughs> that was the best part, too. You're going fishing without a license? Yes, I'm it's going fishing fish, without a license. I'm sick of all the stuff I got to eat. Shit. Well, maybe you shouldn't have taken so much of it then. Well, maybe. That reminds me. I keep hearing reports from Fish and Game about a problem bear they're trying to keep tabs on. Can you search around the lake for fresh tracks and just let me know what you find? There was a crew burning fire lines out to the east, and, um... You know, I think sometimes it riles up the wildlife. To the east? Problem bear? Fuck that. <laughs> uh, huh. Problem bear? Fuck that. I am of the opinion that they are all problems. Come on, please. Ugh. Can't believe I'm gonna leave this planet as a pile of bear shit. Thank you, Henry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, did he actually get something that before, or what? Because, uh, kind of just left me hanging there. I didn't even know what was going on. 
All right, well, we're going to go find this damn bear. Oh, and we're back at the naked teenager camp. I hear ducks. What is this? Someone left their clipboard out here. You take it? It could have been one of the fish and game folks. See if there's a name or a credential or something. I can call it in. All right, fine. Okay, hold on. No, no, no. Oh, shit, son. Did we just throw it away? Whoops. Oh, that's right there. Oh. And it puts it away real quick. We're going to go check it out. And then, um... Should we go do this mission right now? Wait till tomorrow? What do you guys think? Let's examine this bitch up. There it is. What? The, uh, it's... Holy shit. Biggest fire of the year. What's going on? You didn't actually find a bear, did you? Someone has written down what we said to each other. Have been saying. That uh -huh. doesn't make any sense. Uh, I don't talk to the other lookouts as much as I talk to you. Not in the same way. Wait, hold on. Something's out here. Oh, fuck. Henry, I'm worried. Well, we're keeping this shit. You didn't find and eat any mushrooms, did you? I mean, they can be fun, but also, <laughs> you know, devastating. That there, my Regardless, friend. Just let me know. Would okay, be an Bukaroo? elk, right? Oh, God. Is it I an elk? I just called you that. Oh, shit. It's a radio. What? What the fuck is going on here? Oh fuck, son! Motherfuckers! And that's the end of the game, ladies and gentlemen. Are you there? I'm just kidding. <laughs> they did not like me what stealing happened? their fucking clipboard. I, holy hell, I just I got hit in the head, punched or something by someone. Are you serious? What the hell is going on out there? The fuck? I don't know. Jesus Christ. Let me get this straight. You found a clipboard with, what, transcripts of our conversations? What else is on it? I don't know. It's gone, along with a radio of theirs. Somebody out here could have just killed me, Delilah. I don't... Run, what, nigga, run! What the fuck is going on? What's Wapiti Station? I, 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 I don't know. I saw the name Wapiti Station right before I was cold cocked. Does Wapiti Station mean anything to you? Wapiti Meadow. Maybe it's Wapiti Meadow. It's it's on our maps. It's not too far from where you are right now. It's north of the lake. It, it looks like there should be a trail somewhere on the north shore of Jonesy Lake. I'll uh, I'll start hiking that way now. God damn it, my head. Oh, we're gonna go are fuck you, shit up. Are you sure you saw what what you saw, Henry? Maybe you pissed off some more campers and they came back to sucker punch you. Mm, yeah, no. I know what I saw. Why would I make this up? Just there are people gone. listening. It seems like a like a misunderstanding or something. There are people listening to our conversations. The person or these people were hiding in the bushes down here. What the fuck, D? I don't know, Henry. This sounds crazy. Yeah, and you're not the one who just saw our words on a clipboard out in in the middle of nowhere. Those words were from two weeks ago. No, they were. So. What's to say that they don't have transcripts from three, four, or five weeks ago? Our entire relationship, friendship, our, our whole summer. Someone is out here with the walkie-talkie taking notes and talking to God knows who. The fuck? Well, what? Bear poops? What's going on? We should leave. Wait for the mom. I'll, I'll hike get... out there and get some answers. Great. Go fuck shit up, my Just cat. keep a clear head. Don't, you know, do anything crazy. Like taking a job in the middle of nowhere with literally no escape from whatever or whoever is out there? Well, I meant, like, kill anybody. Whoa, Delilah, there's a big chain-link fence between me and the meadow. I, I don't think I can get past it. Uh, a fence? Yeah. How big? Big. It goes off in both directions. Acres. But what the fuck is going on out here? Whatever it is, someone doesn't want anyone to know about it. Sometimes biologists will cordon off a little area to study flora or whatever, but that's only a few square feet usually. That's not what this is. <sighs> well, see what you can do to get past it. Yeah, I've tried to get in here before. No dice. <sighs> Shit. I, I, I don't know how long I can dick around out here until someone notices. God, 
if you were an actual on, firefighter, you'd have that gate down in two shakes. Hey, actually, those guys doing the controlled burn, they might be able to help. Where are they? Beyond Ruby River, there's a scout camp. They burned a line a few days ago that should let you hike right to them. Well, that's great. If they haven't left, they're probably the type of guys who would help you get through that fence. All right. Well, I don't want to keep you guys up because uh, this, this is going to be a long trek all the way over to Ruby Ridge or where, where the fuck is it? Let me see. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. All right. So we got a gate there in Wapitidi. What? What PTD? What PTD station? And we gotta get over to. Where do we have it? Oh, right here, Ruby, Ruby River. So we gotta get all the way over there. So I think we're gonna cut it off here, guys. Yeah, I'm gonna cut it off here. But uh, I'm gonna try to get you guys another episode here pretty soon. So uh, if you guys liked any portion of this episode, make sure you guys go down there, smash the like button. You guys know what to do. All right, guys. So that's gonna do for me. I'm dizzy, Aaron. Nah, I am out. <laughs>